Hi yogis, Shauna here. Welcome to All Things Props. So props are literally my best friend in yoga. Some people get a little sketchy when they hear props. They think of them like a crutch or something that uh, just inhibits your yoga practice. But for me personally, they add to my yoga practice. They make it so I, I'm in better alignment. I can go deeper into poses. They do exactly what they were created for. So I just wanna introduce you to some of the props in yoga. If you plan on having a regular home practice, it would be a good idea to invest in these props just so you can bring them out, turn on a little video, do your practice um, so that they're available to you so that you can move more deeply into poses. We use props for several reasons. One of the main reasons is for alignment. If we get into a posture and our alignment's off, sometimes we just add a block and it brings the floor a little bit closer to us. So that's a good reason for props. Another reason is it can, like I said, the blocks can help bring the floor closer, but the strap can help elongate your arms. So when we go into an extended um, leg, going in for a stretch, sometimes it can feel really tight through the hamstring. Sometimes it helps just to add that little strap, lift the heart, bring the chest forward, as opposed to rounding the back and curling like that, keeping the alignment of the spine straight so we can move more deeply into the pose. So straps are awesome for that. Bring more length to the arm. Next, we have our blocks <clears throat> that can really help with bringing the floor closer to us. So for me especially, I have shorter arms. Some people have like these beautiful long yogi arms, which I love, and I don't. I have beautiful short yogi arms. So for me, it helps to bring the floor closer. When I step forward into a lunge, and I lift up my back leg, it creates more space in the heart and the belly so I can move more freely. If I take the blocks away, whoo, it really um, traps me in, it closes my heart, it rounds my back, and then you can see the alignment so much better when I'm lifted on the blocks. Blocks you can also use to sit on, to do a chest opener on, a lot of great, great movements you can do with blocks. So these are an awesome prop to invest in. And then the yummy props are yoga blanket, which I'm seated on right now. But you can also use the yoga blanket, you can open it up. And when you're in tabletop, you can put the knees on the blanket. It helps to protect the knees. I don't have really bad knees, but they can get cranky when I'm on just the mat and the hardwood. <clears throat> so a blanket can really help with that. Also, when you're in Shavasana or you're seated, you can put the blanket on your lap or on belly to really get this sense of grounding in. So sometimes when we feel like we're whoo, all over the place, a blanket can help just settling. Ah, I feel closer to the ground, closer to earth. So our blanket. And then our bolster which is super yummy. This is awesome for restorative postures, for seated. Chances are, if you ever visit me in a studio, I'm always seated on a bolster. I'll give the option, blanket, bolster, or the mat, and you'll find me here. I sit on a bolster, I put my ankles on a blanket, comfort is the key. Ah, this is home to me, <laughs> this is like, Meditation seat, pull the shoulders down the back, nice and comfy. So we can use the bolster for that. It helps to open up the hips, really relieves any stress on the hips, but also you can use it for restorative postures. So I'm gonna show you one of my favorite that's a heart opener. If you already have these props at home, then come on with me. Just put one block down, put our bolster just right on top, you can get extra comfy with it and put the blanket right next to the bolster. Come into seated, <clears throat> feet in front, and then we'll just roll down. <sighs> Open the heart, maybe the knees drop in toward each other. Oh, 
I could stay here all day. Mm, props. So we have our, our blanket, our strap, our blocks, whoops, and our bolster, which are awesome to have for your home practice. I bought all these props right here at yogaaccessories.com. They don't pay me, but they were a reasonable price. The blanket I did buy um, like the mid grade. I like a little bit thicker blanket. I think it was 20 bucks. And the blocks sometimes are sold separately or sometimes in pairs. And also at Yoga Accessories, sometimes they'll do a buy one, get one for the bolsters, which is really great because you can get two bolsters for like $40. It's awesome. And yeah. So everything I got at Yoga Accessories. I have bought the straps sometimes on Amazon for like $3 a strap. Super awesome price. You can find some really good deals sometimes. Optional prop is a cute little dog Daisy in the corner. So um, she's always nice to have. She gives us some good Zen energy. I hope this served you. Like I said, if you plan on having a home practice, these are worth the investment. It has been my honor to share this information with you. Namaste.